blossom. Oh, yeah. It's from Fibre Fruity. She's made it herself, I think. Or she sells it herself. Not sure, you have to let me know, Jill, if you make it or you, you sell it. Essential. Let me have a look. Can't get here, my fingers are not working. Oh. I waited until my fingers had come together a bit. Oh, yes, it is essential oils. Pain relief. Keep out of your eyes. It's essential oil. I could do that today, to be honest with you, Jill. Oh, it smells... Oh, I'm sure you're going to tell me what it's made out of. I can smell a variety of different things. I'm sure it says so on the card. I'll have to study it. <laughs> but I can, t I can detect, you know, different... What do you call them? Undertones? Whatever, I'll put that back down there. Something else wrapped up. Oh, these are definitely, I'm still waiting for my son to jet wash my deck in. But it's not been the weather, to be honest, because once he's jet washed it, he needs to put a protective layer on it. And he doesn't want me to put anything strong on the deck in. So he's finished doing that because he said he'll only have to take it all off again, which I understand, I understand. But I am say, still saving up all my flowers, so there you go. So if anybody has any flowers to send to me, please, I shall be thrilled, thrilled. I've got to make some myself as well. Can't let everybody else do it, not me, can I? Oh, did I have that the wrong way around? No, I didn't. That one. That's pretty, isn't it? Purples and yellows. Yellows and greens. My deck's going to be lovely, isn't it? This spring. They're so pretty, thank you so much. Oh, I've got one more parcel. I have really been spoiled. Really, really been spoiled. everything with care. Oh, a baby voucher. Oh, that is so, so kind. Oh, now you really have spoiled me now. So now I've got three vouchers to spend. I've already spent my um, Amazon one. That came from my niece, I already spent that. But I've got a hobby, hobby craft one. I've got a Marks and Spencers one, which will be spent on some underwear. Because you know, we ladies always need some new underwear. And um, so that's what that will be spent on. Well, that is a lovely surprise. Kelly's waiting for this video to go out so she could look at it as well. <laughs> it's a shame she wasn't here to help me undo it because she absolutely loves unboxing things. She loves them. Even when she knows what she's got and she's ordered it herself, she still loves the unboxing. But um, as I've joined Erin's, um, you know, the, I don't know whether you've seen it or not, the Crafting from Stash for 2020. Uh, that she started. It's on uh, Facebook, I think. You just join it. Um, and the idea of it is you set yourself a, a, a thing of what you're going to spend each month. And if you don't spend that amount, then you're allowed to roll it over and roll it over so that when you do need something that maybe costs a lot more money, you've got the money there. Say, for example, you set yourself $20 a month. You didn't spend it. So the next month you would have $40 and then the month after that you would have $60. And also if you finish things off out of stash, Erin uh, is going to allocate you 
um, sort of some extra, I mean she's not giving you the money, don't get me wrong, uh, she's just saying that you can spend an extra, you know, two dollars, an extra four dollars, she's added it to your, um, you know, the amount that you're allowed to spend. Yeah, I mean you're not being given any money, don't get that wrong, no. Um, no, but it's, it's a nice idea because you know how much stash I have got. I have got to get it down. And also, you know, with the overspend at Christmas time, like you always do and you always say you won't do, um, I need a few things like paint and stuff like that, you know, in, to finish off my bedroom and even the curtains and things. Uh, so I need to recoup. Plus my lovely bank keeps sending me little messages via my phone saying Bing you are overdrawn Bing you are overdrawn I was like yes I know <laughs> I always am at Christmas but then I always sort it out by January and February so why are you worrying because I'm not so all right you have to pay charges yeah but you know so what I'm not skimping myself, skinting myself, whatever the word is, scrimping, you know, not to buy the nice food or the nice whatever. But I mean, like, for example, this week, all I've bought is um, a loaf of four paninis because I had everything else in that I, I, I care to mention until I go out again on Saturday with my niece. Um, my budget will mostly be spent on um, crochet magazines because I can't bear to be without new crochet magazines. I have to have them even though I don't like what's in them. When I buy them, I have to have them. It's like a big compulsion. Like some people can't pass whatever stall, some people can't pass, with me it's crochet magazines. If it's a new magazine, I have to have it, yeah. And um, as for t resolutions, really, I'm not really making any because I don't really keep them. My sort of aim, let's say, is to use a lot more yarn than what I buy. <laughs> Which, you know, isn't hard to do because I've got quite a bit to choose from. And some more now, thank you very much. Um, so that's what I shall be doing this year. So I'm looking forward to catching up on some videos which I am woefully, woefully behind on. Um, the only ones I've been catching up on are the ones that have been like five and six minutes long. You know, when I look and they're like 45 minutes or an hour long, I'm like, no, I'll look at that later. No, I'll look at that later. So consequently, I've got about a fortnight solid watching to catch up on in the new year. Some, sadly, I probably will never catch up on, but, you know, the intention was there. And if I don't leave any comments on your video, it doesn't mean I haven't watched them. It means sometimes that I've watched them on the TV and I mean to go back to my PC and put a comment, but of course, you know, it's out of the head. So don't be offended if you don't get any comments on your videos, as I said. Anyway, I'm probably gone over time, so I shall, hopefully, it won't be in two videos, but I will see you on Saturday if I don't see you before. I'm hoping to get a bit of energy, a bit of crojo so I can start doing something. So in the meantime, Happy New Year, and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye now.